Flames light up to cook food in the local restaurants, while business owners feel the burn on their livelihood. I used to be able to buy uh, tuna, fresh ahi uh, sushi grade tuna, for about five dollars for a loin. Now that tuna is about twenty to twenty-five dollars. So my profit and my loss is right at this point where I could decide not to do this or continue with this business. As COVID worries lessen, inflation raises concerns with costs rising for consumers and businesses alike. Basically everything went up. My uh, HOA has gone up, my rent is going up, labor has gone up, raw cost goes up, then prices goes up. It's a vicious cycle. There's a equipment tax. So every year they tax me on owning this table, this cooler that I need to provide fresh products to my customers. In order to uh, mitigate that, I have to raise my prices. And I'm, I am very reluctant to do that right now, but eventually we'll be forced to raise the prices. In spite of the financial that's, burden, that's businesses like crab, Pacific yeah. Kitchen managed to survive, determined to keep their own fire burning. I've started uh, my own business when I was uh, 28 years old. If you have a dream, anybody that has a dream will work much, much harder for his dream. After this pandemic, it's taken everybody's dreams away. And people are just be, uh, more, a little more hopeless, I feel like. And I hope that changes because, uh, again, you know, small business is a great opportunity for young people to come in and realize their dream if they put their effort in it. For Canyons News, this is Zach Imperial.